Hello, welcome to the channel. Um, if this doesn't resonate, check your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter, you guys. All right, stick around. Um, I do have some free personal readings coming towards you guys, okay? Everyone's going to get two free personal readings, so please stick around. I'll let you know how to do that in just a moment. Um, again, though, you guys, make sure you check out your other placements. If this does not resonate, it is a general reading, all right? Let's get started. Hi Aquarius, where you guys been? I missed you. Let's jump into your reading. Let's see what's going on for my Aquarians. What do you need to know at this time? What's going on around you? What's coming towards you? Let's see. Um, if you're new, stick around. Okay, I got free personal readings like I already mentioned before. Um, and if you're trying to book a reading with me, that's Leo Sun Pisces Moon dot business dot site. You can message me there. Um, for availability i may be backed up at this time okay i don't know yet but um yeah i just opened back up you guys okay so if you want to book a rating you may do so there we have the nine of swords coming towards you okay first off i don't know why whenever i see this card i always get like the vibe that somebody's going to jail this could be someone you know all right i feel like someone's gonna get caught up okay I feel a lot of deception when I see this car, but somebody's worried about this, okay? It could be you or someone you're dealing with, but um, we're going to keep going. It's a soulmate, they're saying. All, we're all soulmates, right? I don't know why I just heard cellmate. <laughs> soulmate, oh. Okay, so we got the King of Pentacles in reverse. Hey, if y'all are dealing with a Scorpio, go check out their reading because the King of Pentacles showed up in the position um, where the tower is in the position of, how, position of how you're being seen, okay? You may be dealing with a Scorpio. Something going on there. Somebody's going to jail, okay? Something about a Scorpio. That's what I heard. Anyways, you guys. Oh, shit. Because they had that in their reading. Something about addictions. So somebody might be going to jail. Um, um, also, okay, I'm also seeing something about a Scorpio competing with you, all right? Competing with you, you guys. Um, you are seen as the tower, all right? You're being seen as a tower. I feel like you're a rude awakening for somebody here. And the position of how they feel about you is the seven of wands with the three of wands. It's like you're standing your ground. You no longer want to take action towards somebody here. Three of wands is about our ships coming in, right? So some of you guys, it, it's in the reverse. It's like, this is how someone's feeling. Like you're no longer are interested okay you're standing your ground um you have the ten of pentacles mirroring the world card so something about what it is you're doing is going to bring this ten of pentacles in i just heard royalties okay i always get that vibe when i see the ten of pentacles because it's reoccurring all right it's 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 a legacy it's generational wealth this could even be an inheritance i am i am hearing something about a capricorn here um giving you something this could be a mother figure you guys um but i see with this world card in the obstacle position there's something about withholding okay you're i even heard frozen accounts so somebody's accounts could be could be frozen because somebody was stealing from their account again i keep hearing jail somebody going to jail <laughs> Jesus Christ. why does this keep showing up like why do we why do i see that when i see this jail Cause look how like this person's worried and I don't know like the the swords they like with the way they're like sticking out it looks like jail to me it reminds me of the bars you know same thing with the ten of swords I always see the jail like when I look at that I don't know um it's because somebody's refusing to see things from a higher perspective okay so I am hearing someone doesn't think they're gonna get caught. All right, I may even hear you may catch someone, all right, and you may be the reason they go to jail, but I don't feel like you guys are going to tell on this person. I just feel like if you're running a business because you have the Ten of Pentacles here, um, you, have a, you have a business to run, so somebody could get caught on camera doing something that they're not supposed to be doing. Um, I am hearing stealing. I am hearing um, greed. Someone has um, a greedy. Someone is gluten. Someone is glutton. Gluten? Glutton. I heard gluten. Someone is gluten, allergic to gluten, okay? But somebody is glutton. I'm hearing they're greedy. They're glutton. Their gluttony is going to get them entrapped and get them entrapped and turned, uh, turned in, I'm hearing, to the police, 
Okay. Um, also, uh, yeah, because I see it with this Princess of Swords. I'm also seeing um, there's someone who's watching you here with the Princess of Swords with the Two of Cups. This is someone who you moved away from, you guys. Okay. Obviously, this is like why they're watching because they're not in contact with you anymore. Um, they are seeing you guys from another perspective is what I'm hearing. So I'm getting this person may come back around, but this could be someone who may even put you in a third party is what I'm hearing. I know that the three of swords is not here, but I feel like there's some mental anguish around somebody making someone else feel slighted. Okay. But you guys are very analytical. Like your mind is logic. Everything is logic with you. So you may have like may have blocked someone because they were acting funny okay they were moving funny around you this could be a friend also i'm hearing jealous friend with the two with the five i'm sorry with the five of wands it's in a position of how you're being seen as somebody's competition here and it's because you have this ten of pentacles you guys all right um you have a lot of abundance coming towards you though this energy is in the obstacle position i feel like you guys know how to get around it because you guys are logical like i said um, I also heard too, because you guys have just went through a Saturn return, um, something is being gifted here with, uh, I'm hearing something is being, something is karmically being gifted to you. It has always been yours. Okay. It could be an inheritance from the divine or someone in your family. I do get the energy of the divine with the world card. I do feel like it's, it's spirit. It's your ancestors. Um, I feel like it's divine justice to, for you to get whatever this is here. All right, because it seems like you guys are moving away from connections. The Nine of Cups in reverse. Yeah, you guys are moving away from people. Um, and that's why you're being seen as this tower, okay? Uh, you're very, I'm seeing too, like you guys are like being seen as someone who's very detached. You know, okay, you guys are being, to, like, you're someone is being, you're feeling very detached or you're being seen as someone who's very detached. And that is why people are perceiving you as someone who's standing on um, your ground. They feel like you're bull, like, you're, the way you're standing up for yourself or the way you're not, like, into something or you're not attached to something, people feel like it's a, it's a silent move. It's a silent, um, how do you say it, like, um... It's a statement, you know, when you're not, you're not engaging and you're not talking to people, it's a statement. Like, I don't have to talk to you. Look at him. This motherfucker has cufflinks on. <laughs> he is too busy. His mind is busy. He's always thinking about the next move. You guys are focused on something here. And I feel like you're moving away from people who are greedy with their energy, their time. Um, you're not focused on these people. I feel like too, something about your investments are going to pay off here with the Ten of Pentacles. So you've had to wait for a long time, okay? Someone had to wait for a long time. You could be investing in Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies in general. And um, you guys, there are tons of like resources down below if you'd like to accumulate free Bitcoin, okay? You don't have to buy any, um, but it takes like every day. You have to like use it every day. Anyways, um, it's down there if you guys want to use it because I, I know like Aquarians are into that shit. And I know you guys are on... I know you guys know, like, you're, I don't know why I'm getting g Easy vibes. Like, I know he's a, he's a Gemini, but I heard that song, That's the Shit I've Been On. I seen what you're trying to do, but that ain't even kind of new. So I, I don't know why I get that vibes from you guys. Like, you guys are so awakened and you're so hip to the new shit. Like, you are new age. You guys are logistically like one of the most intelligent signs. And I feel like somebody, you know, you guys are really good at investing. So if you are an investor, there's tons of free stuff down there. It's not just tarot shit, okay? <laughs> I'm not just tarot. I'm, I'm a lot of things. I think you guys know already. But if you're investing into something, why not take advantage of the stuff that's down there for free, okay? Um, that's for those who are already hip to the knowledge of the future and know what's up okay i'm not gonna get into it that's for another day but yeah um you guys are really um powerful within your mind you know what you're doing you have intellect your intellectual strength gives you sort of an edge okay um you have a lot of you have a sense of dignity and authority when people see you they know how to respect you they know what to say they know what not to say they know to stay keep their mouth shut when they see you okay um your judgment too, Aquarius, your judgment is very sound. It's based on objectivity to find the honest truth within whatever it is you're searching. I see you guys looking for analytically like the most plausible explanation or the most, you know, 
I am hearing pros and cons. So you're always weighing your options. I feel like that is why you're going to benefit from something here and it's going to be very lucrative, okay? Um, you're really good at weighing the pros and cons of anything you're investing in. Um, whenever you guys also too, like I'm dating, I'm, I'm seeing with the King of Pentacles, you may um, own multiple businesses, okay? So um, they're wanting you to make sure you're researching before making important decisions, carefully weighing all options um, with scrutiny. That is something you already do. They're telling, they're, I don't know why they're reminding you to do that, but I feel like someone has been kind of like forgetting about, I don't know, like someone is forgetting about themselves or something. I don't know why I just heard that. Um, experience has led you to also embrace rules and lead with conscious comp with a conscious compass, okay? Your mind is your compass. You guys also know um, thing. I, I feel like you guys are very intuitive too, all right? Um, with this tower, I don't know why somebody is feeling like you are the tower. Like, I feel if a lot of decisions you make in the next few months, um, you don't have an explanation for it. It's because you acted on your intuition. So I find you guys to be very intuitive, especially my Aquarian moons and my Pisces moons and my, my any sign that has water in their moon. Anyone who has water in their moon, um, they're very intuitive. Or you have Neptune in the eighth house. Or you're a Pluto Scorpio generation. Naturally, um, you just your instincts they kick in. Whenever you're about to do something, or whenever you're gonna make a decision, you already know what to do. Okay, you might like researching a lot too online. You might like to study. That might be the way you um, cope. Is what I'm hearing. That's like a coping mechanism for somebody. Like you literally like to like. It's like you know you guys ever heard of stimming? Stimming, it's like what kids do, you know, so everybody does it. My kids do it. They're both on the spectrum. I feel like that's your studying or your research is a way you stim, if that makes sense, okay? You know, like when some people, they get anxiety, they rock back and forth. I feel like you do a lot of research or you study or maybe you work, okay? It helps you relax. So, yeah, and you get more done. It's like you, you're very pro, you're very progressive and you're very productive, okay? And whatever it is you're doing, that's something to be admired, okay? I feel like a lot of people look up to you. Um, with you being also, the 501s being in a position of where it's at, you being competition means you're the best, okay? So, for you guys who are um, not competing, you know, you're just, every day, you're just trying to be the best version of yourself. That's not how you're being seen. People are seeing you as somebody they got to beat. You know what I'm saying? So that's a compliment in itself. I'm going to go ahead and leave it there, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and put one Oracle message. Um, but if you made it this far, take advantage of your free personal readings down below. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy those. You know, take advantage of all the free stuff that's down there. Because I don't know how long it's going to be free, okay? And, um, you know, if you're trying to book a reading, that's my website, leosunpiscesmoon.business.site. You can also donate if you want to, all right? I got the thanks button, baby. Oh, I'm so excited I got that thanks button. It makes me feel so happy. I mean, nobody donates to my channel, but... I mean, if somebody did, that would just make my day because I feel I work so hard, you know, but I'm not asking for money. You guys, if those of you who do want to, if you do want to support, that means so much to me. I will give you a shout out. I love you guys. You're the, the shit. I love Aquarius. Anyways, um, let's get one Oracle. What do you need to release? Okay, so um, this is like a question you may be needing to ask yourself at this time. For some of you guys, um, it's going to help you bring in more abundance. Whatever it is that you're releasing, think about it. If it's a person, if it's a place, a thing, a mindset, maybe it's a way of thinking. Um, you guys, the minute you do, I feel like your Jupiter is going to come in and bless you here with this Ten of Pentacles. I don't know why I'm getting that. Um, because, you know, Saturn... It's all about restrictions, right? And it's in the obstacle position. So I feel like you guys maybe just went through a Saturn return. A lot of you are between the ages of 28 and 34 years old. So you have just gone through a Saturn return or you're currently going through it right now. That's just That just means that you need to learn from your lessons that you have not yet learned from or um, not make the same mistakes, okay? And when you go through things like that, you are going to be blessed. I see you being blessed in the near future with... Um, something very tangible, okay? It don't have to be money, but I do see like a home, a car, a compound. Somebody's gonna get something. It's inherited, I'm seeing, okay? I feel like a mother figure is looking out 
for you or waiting to see if you um if you're ready for the next phase i keep hearing that too um there's a mother figure a grandmother or a mom or, or somebody i also heard military so someone in the military they they may have fought in vietnam or something like that they have a large sum of money or a, a piece of property they want to give to you they're waiting for you to reach a, a certain age or maturity level i'm hearing um you're gonna get something from them okay and i feel like it's, you're not some of you might not even have to wait for this somebody is going to give it to you right away because maybe they need your help taking care of it i also heard horses so someone might have a ranch okay i love you guys so much you guys have a wonderful weekend and you guys um don't forget to check out your free personal ratings down below namaste